planes have all of my way for Columbus Day. <laughs> so, you will be my audience today. So, today our word is exile. exile. Now, what would be your definition of exile? Can't come back. Can't come back. Alone. Alone. Separation. Being somewhere that you did not choose to be is how I would describe it along with all of those words. Our scripture for, for youth and sometimes for an adult, for youth, if you are in your class and you chose to be in one reading group and not the other, you look and you think, I really, that's where I want to be, in that room over there. I went through that many times with my children with math, even though teachers try to say, oh, they're all the same, all the groups are the same. A kid knows, a kid knows. And our scripture today talks about when we are somewhere where we didn't want to be. When I was reading it, it was almost like God was saying in the scripture, put on your big boy pants and pull them up. That's what it sounded like to me. It sounded like, take a look around. You are in a place where you don't want to be. It's strange. You may not understand the language. You might not know the customs. You might not know the people. But this is your chance to stop looking inward and to look outward. Embrace. Just imagine if you came in and we were all sitting in different seats one Sunday. Maybe we should do that. We should all switch spots. Be wild and crazy. Exile over to a different row of views. And we look at even those people we see every day. We would look at things just a little different because we'd be sitting with somebody different. We would say hello to somebody that maybe we don't get a chance to say hello to. And so in the scripture, God says, take a look around, absorb, embrace what is around you and what new learn and how different your life could be from where you are today. Let us pray. Dear God, sometimes we are thrust into situations that are small for us, but large in our hearts. Help us to embrace the newness and to trust. Trust is the word. Trust that you are on the journey with us, that we know you love us and care for us.